Yo guys, what's going on? King Flipper here and welcome to another Summer Heat SBC. Today we are doing none other than himself, Big Cock Origi. We would we were seeing how long it would take before they did drop an SBC. And you know what? They've double dipped as well for the Liverpool players. We have Duke Cockerigi and we have Jorginho Wijnaldum, which I will be doing an SBC on that. If you've already looked at this one, don't forget to go and check out the Wijnaldum one. It will be in, obviously, the FIFA 20 SBC playlist. Uh, and we'll get into the Origi one, as you can see by the description, just to let you know. And a summer heat, dynamic duo player from Liverpool. And um, as I said, it's Big Cock Origi. So, so we already start off with a 93 rated card, high medium work rates, 6 foot 2, 4 star, 4 star, 94 pace, 90 shot, 85 passing, 92 dribbling, 44 defence and 93 physicality. Then you get into his in-game stats and boy he has some in-game stats. Uh, we got 89 acceleration which is not the best but then they give him 97 sprint speed. Oh my, <laughs> oh my. 92 attack positioning, 91 finishing, 95 shot power, 82, vo 82 long shots and 82 volleys. Would have been nice if it was a little bit higher, but still. 76 penalties. Then we have 87 vision, 87 crossing. Decent free kick accuracy is awful. 93 short passing, which is not bad. 74 long passing and 68 curve. Would have been nice if it was a little bit higher. The dribbling stats are pretty OP as well. We got 88 agility, which is great. And 80 balance is not bad considering he's 6 foot 2. So that's pretty decent there. You got 94 reactions, 93 ball control, 93 dribbling, and 92 composure. Then his defending stats are awful, apart from obviously he has 99 head and accuracy because he's 6 foot 2. That's why he's jumping is 95 as well. So if the ga if if FIFA 20 was good for headering, hello headers all the time uh, 87 stamina which isn't too bad 96 strength and 86 aggression which is great as well but we're not interested in stamina because don't forget everyone's going to bring Garigian as a super sub if you can do what he did in the Champions League he's going to do that for everyone else <laughs> so we get into it we've got three SBCs that one's we ignore that one. <laughs> We've got strong links to Premier League. Before we get into it, just to let you know, these are foot bin bite now prices. The time of doing this SBC, which has been out for 45 minutes, very expensive uh, because obviously you've got a lot of other SBCs that are out at the moment. So even low rate players are worth a lot at the moment. Um, bids and snobs will always be cheaper, and don't forget, prices do fluctuate, as I was saying. Um, so we start off with the strong links SBC. Uh, requirements you need one Belgium or Netherlands player. As you can see, I've got who ate all the pies. Uh, he is the eight, cheapest 84 rated Netherlands player at the moment. Uh, team over a rating of 82. We're bang on 82. Can't lower anyone else. Uh, team chemistry of 70. If you take the two loyal players off, we're on 72. Um, really easy. And 11 players in squad. So, yeah. Um... You can't really try and avoid 82s and 83s if you can, uh, which I've done. I've had to put one 83 rated player to put in lower rated players. Uh, I've got Tadic, who's the cheapest 85 rated card at the moment. Depay is obviously the Belgian player and everyone else is from the Turkish league. But again, try and avoid low rated players. Uh, 82s and 83s, even some 81s are expensive, which you'll see. Uh, we'll start with Muslera. He's 1.5k at the moment, which isn't too bad. It's about right. As I said, there's a lot of other SBCs out. This is why some of these are expensive. Tadic is the cheapest 85 rated card at the moment. He's his team of the year nominee at 12.5k. Uh, Victor Ruiz, uh, 79 rated centre back, 1.9k. Uh, Vida is 1.2k, so yeah, that's about right. Uh, who ate all the pies, as I said? Are you ready for this? 84 rated, normally cheapest chips. Don't forget, he is actually one of the cheapest players. 84 rated, 9.1k. Oh my god. So yeah. Luis Gustavo is 2.6k. Uh, Illich is 2.4k. Balhanda is what, only 1.1k. 80 rated are a good card to go for because they are much cheaper. Charisma is 2.6k. Falco, 83 rated, 6.4k. I would have, I would have, normally Cruz would have been cheaper, but he's actually more expensive. And then Boateng, sem cheapest 79 rated player in the Turkish league at 900 coins. You'd be lucky to get any non rare player for less than 900 coins at the moment, so good luck with that if you can. Um, so I got them for 42.2k, which is not bad. Bids and snipes. 
Easily 40k. I'd say 40k, easy peasy. Small rare mix players pack. That's the first time I've ever seen one of them, which is a 12.5k pack, because it's just half the price of the 25k pack. And then we get to the Premier League one. Uh, again, as you can see, pretty much the same type of SBC. Um, you need one Premier League player. Uh, we've got 86 rated Tarkowski. Uh, you, there is 86 rated Leno, and I think there's an 86 rated um, Ozil. They're all around the same price anyhow, but Tukoski is like the cheapest prop one out of the lot. Team over and of 83, we're bang on 83. Again, can't lower anyone else. Team chemistry is 60. We're miles above that. You take even the three loyal players off around 67, so you can play around with this quite easily. 11 players in squad as well. But, so, I mean, basically I've got Bundesliga, apart from Aragis, who's actually the cheapest 86 rated card, even it's a bonus that he's from the Bundesliga. Tarkovsky, as I said, is the cheapest 86 rated Premier League player. And Schwallow is actually one of the cheapest 86 rated players at the moment as well. So again, I have put them in to try and avoid 82s and 83s because they're ridiculously overpriced. Um, so as you can see, there's a lot of 81s, um, 80s and even 79s because... You know, you'll find out how much they are at the moment. So, Schwaller's domestic man of the match, uh, which is like his orange team of the week card, is 18k at the moment. Tarkowski, as I said, is the cheapest 86 rated Premier League player at the moment at 17k. Uh, Orban is 2.7k. Uh, Nastastic is 1.3k. Uh, Aaron Gies, again, is one of the cheapest 86 rated cards. You don't need him, but just use anyone. 17k. Uh, Zakaria is 2.7k and is an 81 rated card, so do better in what 82 prices are like. Uh, Dabber is actually the cheapest 80 rated card at the moment. Uh, 950 coins. Uh, Gullish is cheaper 79 rated card again 950 coins again as I said you're going to struggle to get any non-rares cheaper than that um, Horn is 2.4k again he's the cheapest 81 rated card that's why he's in that sentiment position uh, Kalu is only a k which is pretty decent uh, and Verghorst again 81 rated 2.5k <laughs> they've doubled in value for what they normally are but I got it done cheaper than what Foot been saying I got it done for 66.5k Again, bids and stops, maybe 60, 60k, easy peasy. Premium mixed players pack, which is a 15k pack, which is god awful. And then again, EA dropping this mixed squad to try and empty out people's clubs for bronze and silvers. Uh, it's 150 coins each player, do not spend more than that. Um, 1.65k, 2k at max, do not spend any more. And a one rare player pack. That is different. It's normally a two-player back. Oh, so they've got even skim skimpier with it. So to do a regi, it is going to cost you at the moment 110k. That's by now prices. I think you can do big cock a regi for about 100k. It's not a bad card for 100k. I can tell you that. Uh, you get 27 and a half k's worth of backs, betting packs. You'd be lucky to get anything decent out of them. I mean. A lot of people are going to do it. Any Liverpool supporter is definitely going to do it. A lot of people are going to do it because hopefully you want to be one of the best super subs in the world. Um, so let me know in the comments below what you think. Can't wait for the comments of all the cockerigi. Uh, thank you very much guys for watching this video anyhow hopefully I saved you some time and some money if I did feel free to drop a thumbs up it does help the channel and the video obviously if you're new and you want to see more SBC method methods for FIFA 20 or definitely FIFA 21 don't forget to hit that subscribe button make sure you have that notification bell on so you can keep up to date as soon as I upload these but for now thank you very much for watching I'll see you guys in the next video stream take it easy and obviously peace